In his recent speech to the Federal Assembly, Russian President Vladimir Putin affirmed that while Russia is executing its armament programs, it is also taking into account its experiences from the wars it has waged, which it refers to as special military operations. This means that some types of weapons are being developed more intensively, while others are being left by the wayside. Military expert Viktor Murakovsky places the Terminator Fire Support Combat Vehicle, which is feared by the Ukrainians, among the latter. According to Viktor Murakovsky, the Terminator's days are numbered. He says that the Russian defense industry will henceforth prioritize the development of those tools that have proven worthy of investment. The expert believes that the fire support tank developed in Russia, which is nicknamed the Terminator, is not worth further development. What is the Terminator combat support vehicle, and why has it failed to live up to expectations? Its primary goal is to fight against large numbers of enemy infantry armed with armor-piercing weapons. The Terminator was designed to cover heavier, less maneuverable tanks in difficult conditions, such as urban warfare, Murakovsky explained to Moskovsky Komsomolets. He said that the main advantage of the weapon is its short reaction time to detected targets. This is ensured by maximum automation of target detection, aiming, and firing. The machine behaves like a robot. This is the origin of the Terminator name, the expert said, adding that the advertising was good. But in practice, this combat support vehicle has not proven to be effective. Explaining this conclusion, he pointed out that since its presentation a few years ago, the Terminator has not become a mass phenomenon among tank forces, and is generally used independently or with infantry fighting vehicles and armored personnel carriers. Murakovsky also noted that Terminators do not adapt well to fighting infantry, and that their control and communication tools are inadequate, and military offices training does not meet modern requirements. One of the most glaring problems he mentioned is that the support tank is not equipped with high-caliber weapons. Small-caliber weapons can only suppress manpower, but not destroy it. The poetic question arises, is there a need for a separate vehicle for such limited tasks as suppressing infantry at short and medium ranges? The expert asked, adding that the Terminator does not have fundamentally new reconnaissance capabilities, which makes it difficult to use. However, Viktor Murakovsky noted, this is not the first time in the history of the Russian armed forces that the cart has been put before the horse. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. And be sure to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any new uploads. We appreciate your support and hope to see you again soon.